You are your biggest asset, so don't be afraid to invest in yourself. You deserve it. Hello, friends, and welcome to Clayton's Motivational Journey. You know, in life, we always want to improve our situation. We want to get ahead. We want to have a different lifestyle sometimes. But a lot of times, we are afraid to invest in ourselves. You know what? You are your biggest asset. So why not invest in yourself? And there's many different ways you can do that. You know, you can invest in yourself very simple by looking after your health, improving your situation at work, or improving your skills. There's many ways to do that, you know. A lot of times, as we grow older, we are afraid to invest in ourselves. We don't take the courses. We don't buy the book. We don't get the gym membership. And I don't know why. You are your biggest asset. So why not look after yourself? Why not invest in it? Why not improve your situation? You know, and it can be very simple. Take a time for yourself is invest in yourself to recharge your batteries. Get your mind right so you can attack the day or the week or the month. You know, or take in a new course so that you can improve your skills to make yourself more valuable at your position. Or learning a new skill so you can start a new business. It don't matter what it is, guys. You got to be willing to invest in yourself. You know, if you're not going to invest in yourself, who is? And I look at it like this. We always tell our kids that you need to take courses to improve their situation in life. They need to learn more skills. They need to do this, need to do that so they can have a better future. But yet, we don't do that ourselves. As we grow older, we don't think we have to invest in ourselves. Well, that's crazy, guys. All the most successful and richest people in the world, and I'm not saying you need to be rich to be successful, I'm just using an example, they're always investing in themselves, they're taking courses, they're improving their situation, they're hiring coaches to help them, they're eating properly, learning how to eat properly, they're learning a new skill so that they can make themselves more valuable, so why can't we do that? As you all know, I'm a big sports nut, but you think that the best baseball players don't go out every day and invest themselves. A lot of them have number of coaches that they pay for themselves. They pay for a strengthening coach. They pay for a fitness coach. They pay for a uh, coach to help them with their eating. They pay for a coach to watch videos with them. They do all this because they're trying to improve their situation because they know they are their biggest asset. So why can't we do that? So guys, if there's something you want to do, if there's something you think that will help you improve your situation, don't be afraid to do it. If you want to take a course that will help you get a better job at work or it might help you start a new business, do it. If you need a personal trainer to help you get in the shape you need to be in to live the life you want, do it. You know, guys, it don't matter what it is. If you need to take some time every week for yourself to recharge your battery so you have the energy to go attack the new job you want or the new position or the new business you want, do it. You know, it doesn't matter what it is. Don't be afraid to invest in yourself. And it doesn't matter what other people think. If you think it's going to improve your situation, do it. Guys, you deserve it. You know, I can't emphasize this enough. And I'm a big reader of books. Books is a simple way to improve yourself. But a lot of times we don't want to pay the price for the book or we don't want to buy the book or we don't want to spend the time reading when it can really help us. So remember, guys, you are your biggest asset. Don't be afraid to invest in yourself. You deserve it. Hope this tip helps a little bit. Thanks for tuning in. If you haven't subscribed already, please do and hit the little bell so you get notice of future videos. And remember, guys, go do something today your future son's going to thank you for. Have a great day, friends.